A demonstration is set to get underway at this hour on the East Tennessee State University campus in support of the Buccaneers men's basketball team. Welcome into News Channel 11 at 530. I'm Sarah Diamond. I'm Josh Smith. Thank you for being with us. This show of support really comes after significant community pushback. After team members and ETSU coaches kneeled during the national anthem before a recent game. The coach, Jason Shea, said it was not intended as disrespect for the flag of the country. He said it was a call to action against racial inequality and inequity, rather. Ansley Daniels, live tonight from the demonstration. Ansley, what are you hearing from people at the event about why they wanted to come out? Josh and Sarah, as you can see, this crowd has grown so much within the last 30 minutes. We've been told that this march has been uh, organized by the graduate students in the counseling program. But within the last 30 minutes, I've really seen a diverse group of people out here. I've seen several people with shirts. I've seen several people that are, appear to be students. I see several community members and even some faculty members out here tonight wanting to show support for the basketball team. As you both mentioned before, within the last week, the team has had a lot of backlash from that decision to kneel during the national anthem at this at that game. They've had that backlash from local lawmakers, from state lawmakers, and other community members. But again, tonight, this group says this is all about support for the basketball team. They are wanting to show them that they stand in solidarity with them. I am told that this march will only take place here on campus. It's not going to leave campus. And I'm told that they plan to kneel at the end of the march near the library. Live in Johnson City, Ansley Daniel, News Channel 11.